everybody, this is John. Welcome to the free video. I want to talk about uh, bonds. I know it doesn't sound very exciting, but uh, there's some interesting plays going on here. Now, I'm looking at the 30-year bond futures, but you can also play this with the ETF TLT. Uh, the reason I'm looking at the bond futures is that you get better signals on the futures because they trade for 24 hours. So we've got a daily chart here, uh, daily chart here. You can see we've got all the ready, fire, aim. But the most important thing here is we've got a green 10x bar. It's the first one we've seen since mid-March. Uh, typically, when you see something like that, that's a turn, okay? Plus, you got a head and shoulders reversal, and you have a massive daily squeeze setting up. So I do think we're about to see a pretty solid rally in bonds. So why is that good? Well, if bonds are rallying, interest rates are coming down. And if interest rates are coming down, we should also see the S&P 500 stabilize. Uh, I don't know how much it's going to help tech. Tech, frankly, is being attacked as excess valuation, just as crypto is. Um, that's part of the goal of the Fed is to wipe out excess speculation in this market and create kind of that wealth effect where, you know, when people had a lot of money on paper, they felt wealthier, so they bought a lot of crap. That leads to inflation, along obviously with many other things that are happening in the world. But if they're down a lot, the money in their bank account is going to seem like they want to save it instead of spend it. That's real. And, um, and they've accomplished that goal. So now, once they, since they've accomplished that goal, things can kind of steady out here. It does not mean that stocks are going to like go merrily back from whence they came. Shopify is never going to see $1,800 again. It's done. It's trading near a fair valuation for what it does. So, uh, so this is something that's interesting. If you're looking for kind of a longer-term trade, buying calls here on TLT. Uh, with the idea, could we get back to the falling 200 SMA? That's $140. That's a pretty decent chunk away. I like that trade. Uh, for something like this, I'm looking at going further out, uh, probably like some September, uh, in the money calls or an at the money call debit spread or something like that, and just kind of holding on through the wiggles. All right? That's what I got. I uh, got a lot more to cover in the premium video tonight, which I'll get started on that. You guys have a good one, and we'll see you at the next update. Hey, John here with Simpler Trading. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, comment down below and let us know what topic you want to see us cover next. Also, be sure to subscribe and click the bell icon so you can get notified when we release new videos. And if you want to watch us trade in real time using our own money, go to simplertrading.com and learn how to sign up. Good trading, and we'll see you next time.